In this video, I'm going to show you take markers with lanes in Reaper. So I created a project and I recorded four passes of vocals, as we could see right here, one, two, three, and four. And I created them in lanes by going to options, new recording that overlaps existing media items, and chose to add lanes. So it added lanes on each pass of a recording. And we could hear each one by soloing them. I'm so beautiful without you. That's lane one. I'm so beautiful. Lane two, and so on. So now I want to comp this vocal. And we could do that by right clicking, go to comping, and choose comp into new empty lane, automatically creating comp areas. And that creates a new lane up here with new areas based on the items below. So if we want to hear lane one, it's right here. I'm so beautiful. Click over here to hear lane two, and so on. Or we could just hit the T key to switch through each lane. I'm so beautiful. I'm so beautiful. And we could do that in each section or phrase of the vocal. But if you're dealing with a lot of lanes, you might want to mark what you think of each phrase. For example, let's hear the first one. I'm so beautiful. Let's say I really like the word beautiful. We can mark this with a take marker. If we go to the actions menu, show action list, type into the filter, take marker. Right over here is an action to create a take marker. We could also use this one which is a bit quicker, but it doesn't allow us to name it or give it a color right away. So I prefer to use this action. And as you can see, there's no keyboard shortcut assigned to it by default, but we could add one right here. I'm gonna choose F3, but of course, you can use any keyboard shortcut you want. So now I could put my mouse in an area I'm so beautiful. and mark it based on what I think of that phrase. Put my mouse over here, hit the keyboard shortcut. I can type in great, beautiful, hit OK, and it shows up right here. So now we know what we think of that word or phrase. Let's hear the next lane. I'm so beautiful. Maybe we liked the I'm so, put our mouse over here, hit the keyboard shortcut, label it, hit OK. Now we can see it right over here. Go to the next one. I'm so beautiful without you. Maybe this one is bad. We could still label it. Go to the next one. I'm so beautiful without you. Maybe this one is great. Add a take marker and label it that way. And now we know what we think of each section. This one had a great, beautiful. I'm so beautiful without you. But I liked the I'm so on this one. I'm so beautiful without And this one was bad, but we can create a separate section for the I'm so and another one for the beautiful. I'm so beautiful. Make it perfect. I'm so beautiful. And for the last section, maybe we like this one. I'm so beautiful without you. And just like that, we chose the best pieces in this phrase. Now, if it takes too much time to type in all this text, we could also just use the colors. Let's move on to the second phrase, starting with lane one. Now my skin glows and it shines like glue. Maybe we just think this is okay. We could still add a take marker, but not give it a name. But it stays this yellow color. And for the next lane, now my skin glows and it shines like glue. Maybe we love this one. So we could add the take marker, but change the color to green, letting me know I like this one, but not adding any text. 
Go to the next one. Now my skin glows and it shines like glue. Maybe I hate this one. So for this, I'll give it a red color so I can quickly see I don't like this one. Maybe I like this one. We'll make it green again. And now, if we have a lot of different lanes to choose from, we can quickly see the ones we liked. This one and this one, and just comp between them. Now my skin now my skin and not bother with this one, as we marked it that I didn't like it. And we save some time by not having to put text in the take marker. We just use the colors. Yellow, green, red, and green, or any colors you choose. Just makes it a bit quicker to do this. And we can still do it in different sections. Maybe this section is okay, but over here is kind of bad. Now my skin glows and it shines like... So over here, we can make it red. Maybe we hate this section over here on this lane. Now my skin glows and it shines like glue. Label this one as well with the red color. And now we know we don't like this phrase over here or here. Maybe we love it over here. Now my skin glows and it shines like glue. I'm pretty without you. We can quickly see right over here. And then choose this phrase over here, maybe this one over here, and get that result up here. Now my skin glows and it shines like glue. I'm pretty without you. And we're done and we're happy with our choices. We can right click up here and disable the lanes. And now we see our final choices in here. And if we don't want to see our take markers over here, we can delete them. Alt on the PC, option on the Mac, to delete these markers. But they'll still show up on the lanes they came from. So if you want to recomp, right click, enable lanes. And we still see all those take markers on the source lanes, even though we deleted them from the comp lane. But using this feature, we can label phrase by phrase, lane by lane, which pieces we prefer, which is really helpful if you're recording many lanes. It'd be hard to choose or remember which lanes you liked. So you can mark them with colors or with text to always know which phrases or which lanes you prefer. So that's pretty much it. That's take markers with lanes in Reaper. I hope you learned something. Hope you could use it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bingo, boys, let's go. Mm -hmm.